Camby now has more for the 13th annual Epi's Kids Duathlon. That is right. Let me introduce you to eight-year-old Elle. You're going to be biking around for us this morning. Yes. Okay, good. Now we got to get your helmet on. What? What? Who is on this helmet? Hello Kitty. Hello Kitty. And I like it and it has her name on the side too. So she makes sure that when she does do the duathlon that no one else takes her helmet. You need my help here? Okay, I got gotcha. you. There you go. Okay, she's ready to ride. Now we don't want her to fall off the edge. So be careful, L. All right, so we are done now with the triathlon, right? That has come and gone. We just celebrated the uh, last one, but the duathlon is going to live on. So what? How many, how many more years do you hope this will go? Well, I started with Epi's Great Race 35 years ago. This is the 13th Kids Duathlon, so I'm hoping we'll hit 45. Okay, now she's going to be biking, but what happens after they bike, or do they run first? What they happens first? They run first. Okay. There's three different groups, uh, starting with 13-year-olds all the way down to, we've had three-year-olds. Okay. And there's age-appropriate uh, distances from a half mile for the little kids to two miles. For the bigger kids. And it happens at Discovery Park. Discovery and, Park. Which is nice about that because the parents can watch the kids go yes, around. Yes, they can. And if parents want to accompany their children, they certainly can do that. And uh, you literally can see the kids virtually through the entire race, except for the oldest kids who go down the American uh, River Park. Which right makes a couple of miles. That makes sense. But you know, as a parent, you want to be able to keep an eye on your kid, make sure that yeah. they're on the right track and they're yeah. doing okay as they're biking and. Uh, and running. And so if people want to sign up, they still have time. When is this happening and how can they sign up? Two weeks from today. And they can actually sign up that day at 7 30. The okay. first event takes place at 8. We have an epic challenge for kids that are physically challenged. Uh, we work, and uh, one of our benef uh, beneficiaries is the Shriners Hospital for Children. And uh, we've provided bikes. And it gives kids that are physically challenged a chance to participate in athletic events that they don't usually have the chance to do. Yeah, I love that. I love that the duathlon is going to continue. Okay, Elle, your brother can't be here today because he has basketball, you told me. But who would win in a race, you or him? My brother. He would? That's because he's older, right? <laughs> yes. Yes, but otherwise you. You're, are you, you're pretty fast, yes? Uh, kind of. Kind of. Okay, well, she knows her strengths and weaknesses. That's something. T? All right, very good. Yeah, she's